Mark Crossfield here with Golf Online answering your questions. This one, using the hashtag AskAGG. Make sure you're following at Golf Online as well. You can use post questions there or on my at for Golf Online Twitter handle. Um, Timothy asks, are chippers a good idea for someone who struggles with pitching and chipping within 25 yards of the hole? Hashtag AskAGG. If they work, then they absolutely are. You've got a European Tour player who chips one-handed, I think, at the moment, haven't you? He's obviously got issues with his chips, and he's just finding a way to make it work. You've got people like um, Adam Scott winning tournaments and playing amazing start of 2016 using now a short putter with a different grip. He's not trying to just go back to what his grip was. He's funking it. He's making it functional. So if you do use a chipper and it helps your performance, absolutely. I've played with pros in regional events who struggle with their chipping. They chip with hybrids. Um, they're chipping and running from 25 yards, 30 yards out because they're worried they're going to duff the ball. So absolutely whatever makes it functional. A chipper generally with its larger sole where it won't dig and you'll tend to, it's, they sit more upright as well. So you'll tend to use them a bit more like a putter. So a putting stroke, which is generally more shallow. Um, absolutely. I would use one straight away. My chipping is rubbish at the minute. And I've actually thought about trying one. Um, but I feel I can conquer my chipping if I just actually practice it maybe once a month. Um, but if I didn't, I wouldn't hesitate in going to a chipper. As long as I get the ball closer than the other person and I win, I'm happy. I don't care if I did it with that mug, you know. It doesn't matter. Don't hold on to pride. Too many in this game have this kind of egotastic pride, don't they? 